Now with some girl power, power in the world of architecture, women are underrepresented in the field, so an effort is underway to turn that around by inspiring and empowering the next generation with hands-on experience. I just love to build and create and design, and I would always look at buildings and say, I wish I could do something like that. Down in Dallas. Where's the measuring tape? They need to get some measurements over here. These young girls are building the blueprint for their futures. We did the X because it was to put more support because this is a rock climbing wall. It's more enjoyable to get hands in and understand what's going on. Exploring the skills it takes to work in fields like science and tech. When you're using a drill, you put your hand at the top of the drill and push down with force so it can go in easier. It's only 23.3% of women in architecture, and I thought that was a great opportunity for girls to get involved. Also, less than 1% of architects are black women. We got a couple more hammers over here that need to help out. That hits the nail on the head for the program's founder, Kelly Flowers, who runs the organization Women Leading Technology. I want you to try different fields, try different industries, have those hands-on experiences so you can find what you love to do. Kelly and her team teaching girls crash courses in architecture, <laughs> building playhouses from start to finish, all for a purpose. We actually build these homes and we donate them to women and children's shelters. This one that we're building today, we're building a Barbie dream house that we're building for kids at a community center. Each four foot tall unit providing joy and comfort to their community. They're innovative, they're creative, they're out of the box thinkers. And these babies, this would have been a mansion. Do you understand? The girls behind the drills. We hope to one day transform tiny homes into shelter for the homeless. We need all different ideas to kind of figure out a way of making buildings that actually help people and keep people safe. I always like giving back to the community as much as I can and doing what I love. Whatever it is that you want to do, do it. Whatever it is you want to do, do it. And this weekend, Women Leading Technology will be trading those pink helmets for evening gowns when they host their fourth annual gala. It is being called a night of intrigue and empowerment. Proceeds going to the organization's initiative to boost STEAM knowledge. Have Not you heard STEM. about this? S-T-E-E, S-T-E-A-A-M, different from STEM. It stands for Science, Technology, Engineering, Arts, Architecture, and Mathematics. That's great. Yeah. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.